Republican White House hopefuls will face off for the fourth presidential debate tomorrow night. News Nation will host the debate at the University of Alabama. And WGN's Shannon Halligan joins us now with a preview of what we can expect. Shannon? Republican frontrunner, former President Donald Trump, will not be taking part once again. But for the remaining candidates, this could be the last chance for them to make their case to a national audience before the primaries. Showdown at the University of Alabama, but it's not for the school's football team. The university in Tuscaloosa will host the fourth Republican presidential debate Wednesday. There's a lot of logistics in terms of planning for the attendees, uh, planning for the attendees that kind of bring their own security detail. Not many of the folks who come to football games kind of have that. The four candidates who will take the stage include Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. Stand on the debate stage and, and let's go. Former UN Ambassador Nikki Haley. We need to know that a strong America doesn't start wars, a strong America prevents wars. Businessman Vivek Ramaswamy. People in my generation feel like the American dream isn't available to them. And former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. I'm tired of seeing the anger. Noticeably missing will be Republican frontrunner, former President Donald Trump. He has skipped every debate so far, citing his wide lead in the polls. News Nation Chief Washington Correspondent Blake Berman said the debate is still important, especially for undecided voters. This could potentially be the last chance the GOP candidates get to make their case to a national audience before the primaries. I think what you're probably going to see is them try to make the argument of, look, I'm the one that can take on Trump one-on-one uh, -on -one when it gets to Iowa, when it gets to New Hampshire, Super Tuesday, the early states, etc., and, and that's soon. The Republican National Committee chose the debate moderators. That will include News Nation's Elizabeth Vargas, Washington Free Beacon editor Eliana Johnson, and Sirius XM's Megyn Kelly. They're not going to be able to give 30-second answers. You can watch the debate on News Nation, part of the Next Star Media Group, the parent company of WGN. The debate starts at 7 tomorrow night. Live in the newsroom, Shannon Halligan, WGN News.